humans are creatures of abilities. God is simply calling us to understand that dream is not just a night slumber. Dream is not just a reflection of your imaginations. Just like some psychologists have told you. But I'm going to give you some uh, understanding between the human imaginations and the dream world. 90% of the times you do not know that all of your physical activities, incidents, involvements, and connections are the margin point of your dreams coming to find experience, coming to find expression in those physical manifestations. And because we do not understand the diversities, the, the, the mysteries behind these two dimensions, the dream world and the physical manifestations, we have allowed Satan to control our physicality. Kronos has been controlled. Kronos has been controlled by Satan and his agendas. We are going to revisit Kronos. Because we are going to be masters and lords over our dream world. Ah, because in that dimension, you can modify, you can adjust, you can delete, you can replay. Oh, come on, you can redirect. Because your dreams are actually the playlist waiting to show in those physical dimensions. In fact, you know the story of Joseph. You all know that Joseph had a dream. That wasn't just a night slumber. That was a dream that must come to pass in the future. Even Pharaoh had a dream of a famine that will come for seven years and a, a seven years of abundance. And that dream came to pass. Dreams are the future waiting to manifest. The dreamer is in charge of the script. That's why if you're not careful of gating and measuring and, and, and monitoring your imaginations, uh, you are releasing unscripted, unedited scripting to the dream world that the powers of the atmosphere will capture to dramatize in your dreams. And the moment they dramatize that script, that unscripted script that escaped through your imaginations, suddenly you will see it find expression through the doors of Kronos. And Kronos will bring the manifestation of your ungated imaginations. Humans are creatures of abilities. You are a creature of powers. The Bible says that this shall be done according to the power that walketh in you. Even God depends on your thinking. God depends on your imaginations. It depends on your degrees to actualize his plans and purposes. The Bible says that God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we decree or think according to the measure, according to the powers that walk it on the inside of the human imaginations for the script. Casting down 
every thought and bring into obedience every knowledge to the knowledge of Jesus Christ the question is you have allowed contrary imaginations to send the scripts into the realms of your dreams which create your physical realities there is another dimension that is exclusively created by God that God has called us to awake to and this dimension is the governing authority over the physical dimensions and the soulish dimension of the dream world it is called the dimension of the human imaginations you are more of a creature of authority if you would unlock the diversities of your imaginations we have unlocked i would say less than 0 0.001 percent of the realm of our imaginations and because of that we are not in control of the incidents accidents and circumstances in this physical world we're not even in control of what is going on beyond this physical world we're not even in control of our dream world you sleep you wake up you have no memories of what you dreamed about what a misery what a disappointment you call yourself a child of god you see nothing in the spirit you don't even acknowledge that that child that person you spoke with is your child yet to be born you can determine the fate of your future you can create your child in the dream world you you can watch who is your husband now you can be married oh come on you can play it up in the spirit in your dream and start your marriage in the dream and end your marriage in the dream to know if this man is the genuine man that you ought to marry or not everything can be started in the dimension of the dreams and end same time to determine what should happen and what shouldn't happen because you are the script writer in the dimension of dreams so before it can be released in this physical dimension you can script your vision you can script your vision you can script your future you can script your health you can script your incidents your circumstances in the realms of imaginations projected into the dream world to be carried out through the manifestation of Kronos do you know that the warfare we are called to war is to cast down imaginations because imaginations are powers that create the realities to manifest in Kronos. Haven't you heard that the Bible says, For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, God thinks. I know the thoughts that I think. So the script has been written. And he began to think according to to the script I know before I began thinking it was scripted you are a product of your thoughts but if you don't script your thoughts Satan will influence you with the lies of other people's incidents accidents circumstances diseases fortunes and misfortunes to creep into your imaginations and if you don't catch your imaginations they will create your realities in the world of dreams which will pass through the gate of Kronos to bring your circumstances in this physical illusion we have allowed our ignorance to give the devil control over powers that determine the fate of generations.
As he thinketh, so is he. As he thinketh, so is he. And so that's that's the power. Oh, that's 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 the essence of God in a man. The ability to create, the ability to become, the the ability to evolve. Eliza, Evinia, Ekoradi Nahada. For the season and the age of the manifestation of the sons of God have come. We are not going to die like mature men. The days of death are over. Before you ever die in the physical, it was captured and registered of you dead in the dream world. And you refuse to reverse it. You refuse to raise yourself up. You refuse to change that timeline. You refuse to change it in the reins that can be edited. Ah, you refuse to go back to the back end. Go ask the IT scientist. Every website has a back end. Those who have the passcode to the back end of a website can addict determines what others see in the physical manifestation of Kronos. So that's what happens when we go to bed. We go to bed praying in tongues. When you see your mom, you lay hands on your mom. If your mommy has diabetes, the moment you remove that diabetes in the dream, it will disappear in the physical. Locate your spiritual fashions in the realms. Everything connected to you has a timeline in the dream world. And that's why you have the word of God. The word that you have is not just for talking. The word is the power that changes all things in the dream world. The word of God ought to inspire, influence our scripts that we ought to load into the uh, transportation of our imaginations to travel into the realms of our dreams we increase in spiritual ranks when we capture certain depths in the realms of your sin when we elevate into that encounter something is captured in the realms for the entire frequencies the electricity of zion and be the same your increase in the spirit decreases your canality get the a visit to chronos conference dvd on pastor john's digital library visit www.pastorjohndigitalmedia.com